Nearly two dozen people who demonstrated today are calling for change at a county animal shelter. An animal control officer used his gun to euthanize Toby, a 16-year-old Labrador. The dog belonged to the son of the county mayor. It's happening in Coffee County. News Channel 5's Mark Bellinger is here to tell us what the demonstrators want. Mark? Well, Vicki, most of them want county leaders to make some changes and do whatever is necessary to make sure this never happens again. Nearly two dozen people demonstrated outside Coffee County's animal shelter. It's a sad situation when, um, you know, someone like that has to make that kind of judgment call. Earlier in the week, animal control officer Charlie Brown euthanized a stray dog with his gun, a dog he found lying along the side of the road. His friend Bill Albert, who helps find homes for strays, says Brown thought the 16-year-old dog was in pain. You know, when an animal is, is dying, do you let it suffer? Or do you put it down the best you know how? What Brown probably didn't know is the dog belonged to County Mayor David Pennington's son. Toby was Brian Pennington's longtime pet. I was devastated that it happened to my son, but also I would be devastated if this happened to anybody else's son or daughter. But of course, it being my son, it gets a lot more publicity. The Animal Control Department is not only under fire for the shooting incident, but also for dumping dead animals. Normally, vets euthanize the animals, and they're stored in a freezer until a private company hauls them away. The freezer has been down, but they got a brand new freezer. So, yes, uh, I'm sure there was some in a dumpster. Most of the protesters hold no ill will toward Brown, but they're pretty upset with the mayor and other county officials. Usually a veterinarian euthanizes animals with a lethal injection, but in this case, a vet wasn't available. So the animal control officer made the decision to shoot the dog. Most of the protesters feel the county put the animal control officer in a bad position. We think it would probably be a director issue and a county issue. It is illegal in Tennessee to euthanize pets with a gun unless it's an emergency. The sheriff's department handed the case to the district attorney, a district attorney, Nikki Lane. He says criminal charges won't be filed in the case. The reason dog owner Brian Pennington does not want to press charges. Vicki. Mark, thank you. The Animal Control Department in Coffee County reports to the county's Health and Welfare Committee. The committee has called an emergency meeting to discuss what happened and what changes should take place. It's Monday and it starts at 5 o'clock.